Uh, let's have a look at some of the uh, inside pages. What have you got? Next? Well, this one here is, um, oh, it's quite, uh, there you go. It's the bizarre new parenting fad, Valentine's Gifts for Children. Uh. So it's not enough that you're expected to give a gift to your partner, your other half, your loved one. But in just over a week's time, when it's Valentine's Day, uh, apparently there's this uh, idea about giving... Oh, sorry, it's gone a bit wonky. <laughs> there we go. I'm so shocked at this news that I'm, I'm all skew. But, yeah, you're supposed to give Valentine's like Day gifts what? to the family. Well, it says here, for example, for, for pets, you can give, to like, dogs and... Uh, for dogs and cats, you can give toys for kids you can give you know uh, cards and and just you know pajamas and things so you're supposed to give i i feel like come on it's, it's i don't know why we're shocked surely uh, this is just the commercial world saying buy already. some more stuff if you basically. love someone get them gifts any time of the year not on february the 14th yeah um now i'm not going to say the name of these personal assistants because they may start going off around the country <laughs> but um there's uh, a research project that's underway um it's two hundred twenty thousand pounds worth of research which i suppose in the big scheme of things isn't that much because what they're hoping to do is use these digital assistants to be able to recognize things like tone of voice and crucially things like sarcasm so the headline there that your uh, your smart speaker may laugh at dad jokes but it says there is a really serious underlying issue that at the moment a lot of these devices can do things that we ask them to do but they're hoping that they'll be able to be a bit more clever by being able to recognize things like tone of voice or when people are angry upset or in need and they will be able to respond accordingly but no one laughs at dad jokes well no not I even mean, one of these you, things you appreciate them but you wouldn't yeah necessarily laugh at them well um if just uh, this one here this is in the mail there we go this is uh artists who are uh, they've got virtual their virtual selves so they can perform digitally in virtual reality worlds that's a way of making uh, yeah making money <laughs> by being online and this one looks a bit like ben i have to say this is your <laughs> own little virtual, virtual avatars person. in the metaverse <laughs> so this is where the likes of facebook would have us believe we're mm. all going to live in future in this digital world